everybody. Hi. Today we are going to Clown Burger in Holcomb City, Texas. I heard about Clown Burger from my friend's uncle. I post about it on Facebook. And so I was like, I saw some pictures on there and I was like, okay, that looks good. You know, some homemade hamburgers and french fries. I was like, I'm going to go try that place out. So I actually took David's mom, my mother-in-law, Diane, with us. And I'm glad I saw that my friend's uncle liked it. Because when you pull up, you're like, oh. You oh, know. you've already been there? Yeah, I went oh. with your mom. Oh. And I, <laughs> they pulled up, you're like, okay. Man, to be nice, I mean, it's, it looks a little old and run down. But... All the best places sometimes are hole in the wall. That's exactly what I was about to say. The little hole in the wall mom and pop place are usually the best. So I'm glad we went in. Um, yeah, we went in and there, we were the only, Diane and I were the only women in there. Mm -hmm. Everybody else was like working men that you can tell that it's oh, like a local, very, yes, it's a very local place with a lot of, um, Basically. Yes, that's what I'm trying to say. And um, it's very popular. I mean, I was looking on Facebook and there's people who've been going there since for, I think it's almost 60 years old right now. And, and uh, I think the father owned it and then he retired and handed it down to his daughter. daughter. So, uh, yeah. But like when we were in there, there was this guy, <laughs> it was funny. Uh, this guy was on the phone. He, he was talking to another guy in there. It was all men. It was full. And uh, he was like, oh yeah, I know old Cornbread. Let me call him up. He's like, hey, old Cornbread, how you doing? He was like, yeah, we're still working at the car place. I'm like, oh my gosh, like that is small town. <laughs> it's hilarious though, but it, it's good. Um, I'm interested in seeing what David thinks about it. Um, I think they're a big fan of Elvis. They have a lot of Elvis stuff in there. And big thing to remember if you come to visit, they do have weird hours. I think they're closed Monday, Sunday, Monday, or Monday and Tuesday. You have to check. Um, yeah, the, I think they're open Thursday through, no, wait, sorry, Tuesday through Friday from like 10 to 4, and then Saturdays they're open uh, 10 to like 2. And they're closed like Sunday and Mondays, I believe. We might want to make sure before you head out. I should have known that. I'm sorry. But also, another big thing is they're cash only. So that's a big deal. All right. So we will see you there. All right. Bye. Bye.
Or the other side looks good. French fried James. was really really good so um, <clears throat> it's like fresh ground meat so they have their own ground meat um, they grill they can grill the onions which is what I did this time I grilled the onions because I like them better that way instead of raw um, but they have get, chili dogs they, they have get, corn, yeah, dogs, corn dogs, hot, dogs, hot um, dogs you can get the burger called the kitchen sink which is everything like double yeah everything but it double beef double bacon uh, grilled onions tomato lettuce chili uh, and I guess mayo or mustard, depending on what you want. Or I both. put ketchup on both. it. I put all. I put uh, all three. Yeah. I put pickles, lettuce, tomatoes. So I didn't get that this time. I almost got it. I was really close to getting it. Uh, but I just got a regular double meat uh, with uh, all the veggies. Um, the fries. It's very good. Fries are. You can tell they're fresh cut, they're fresh homemade. made fries. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So they probably have a potato cutter back there because you can tell they're not like pre-frozen and then. And you can see them cooking it. Yeah, so the grill's right behind the truck. Like, right when you walk in, there's a little area. It's just like a little small dining area with, like, three tables. Four ta you know, a little area, too. But there's one table, and then they have uh, two, like, one person, two people table, and then a two people table. And then that, like, the bar stool is, like, a little There's, like, little different areas you can sit. Uh, so it's actually a pretty fancy they little have small. Some other rooms, too. One's in the back. I, I didn't know it was there last time. And then, the, but there's also another room. I've never seen it. Well, it's only the second time there. But both times they have it closed off. I guess this one's really busy. Probably during the <clears> busy <throat> part of days. They open it up. I, I assume during lunch at noon. Mm -hmm. They probably have it for more people that are going to eat in and dine in. Uh, but it's a really the, busy the place. Room, even when we were there at, uh, what, we went there at 1.30-ish? 1 30, uh, and there were still people always, as soon as we, after we got in, there was always someone while we were there the whole time walking in I think in a lot order. of people also take it to go. Some people so. ordered to go. We had a, most actually ordered there. Um, but yeah, that's a good, if you need a good homemade burger, just like a good. It was better than I not, remember. Like not fast food. Like, last really time it was good. good, but this time was like really good. That was really good. I'm going to go back and get Yeah, he was so excited. So. <clears throat> he, I think he liked it more than I thought and, he was going to like it. 
Well, I knew that's always those places and you want to, you know, they always have fresh or, you know, but this one's really good. Was really, I don't know if there's a little different way they, you know, certain meat or the way they fry it, but, you know, I don't know, maybe they use certain grease, but it was really good, so. A certain grease. I don't know, I greasy burger is the best. That's I mean, true. you want good taste. And James loved I mean, the french wanna, fries. You want a healthy burger, but it's <coughs> so not going to be the tasty burger. <coughs> So no, really like, good. yeah, James really liked the french fries. He loves his crackers. He always says crackers, crackers. And then he got his, uh, the french fries. We gave him some of our french fries and he put down his cracker and he didn't want it. It's kind of similar to Smash Mouth. Smash Mouth Burgers? Smash Burgers, sorry, that's a band. Smash Burger. I don't know what they're, uh, I don't Well, because they have the fat, they have the, because it's the ground flat meat like this. And the, the fries are the thinner fries the, that they cut. They kind of remind I me of a little bit. The feel doesn't. It's all a different feel, but I mean, uh, kind of remind me of a little bit. James is telling you how. He liked it. Yes. He He's like, it. I didn't get my burger this time. He got burger last time. But, but no, we, I definitely recommend it. Uh, if you're in the area and you want it, just a good, good homemade, just good burger. You just want a really good burger and fries. Just, a, you know, nothing fancy. Go there. You can get anything on it. So you get chili, bacon, and they're, they're, they're friendly onions. in there too. So. Mm -hmm. They're really nice. So it's a really good place. We definitely, I mean, I recommend that place. That's really good. Okay. We will see you next time. If you like, subscribe.